Hello and welcome to Lesson Picks. In this video, we'll take a look at our newest language tool, our minimal pairs finder. The term minimal pair refers to two words that differ only by a single sound. Speech and language pathologists use these word pairs to focus on specific articulation issues during therapy and assessment. Our new minimal pairs tool takes the power of our sound finder and extends it in a way that makes it easy for SLPs to use in their practice. It's a very powerful tool allowing any sound substitution to be found, not just the common ones you can purchase cards for. Let's get started. First, let's see how to find the Minimal Pairs tool. From any page, click on the Sound Finder and Other Tools tab to get to our language tools. Minimal Pairs is a new tab on the left, right above the keyword search. Notice that we're not logged in during this demo. The Minimal Pairs tool is free for anyone to use without paying anything or even signing up. When you first go to the Minimal Pairs tool, you will see an instructional image in the results area. It will be replaced with your results when you run a search. Let's find all the pictures in our library that differ only by replacing the L sound with the W sound. This is a common substitution and a good example of how to use the tool. First, we need to think of an example of the pairs we're looking for. In our case, we'll use Lake and Wake because they differ only by the two sounds L and w. Remember, you can use any example words that differ only by the sounds you're looking for. We enter the two words and click Get Pairs. The results section is now filled with examples of minimal pairs that match our criteria. Each section has a pair, such as light and white, along with the images that go with those words. If you click More, you'll open up the section to see all of our matching pictures. In addition, you'll see a list of common pairs on the left-hand side. These are the most common pairs in English writing that match your criteria, whether we have pictures for them or not. This is very useful whether using our pictures and materials or not. Notice that if you find a pair we're missing, you can check the box next to it and click Request Images to let us know you'd like us to add them. We generally turn around image requests within just a few days, faster if you tell us it's urgent. Once you've found the pairs you want to use, add them to the tray just like on any other Lesson Picks results page. We'll add eight pictures, four pairs, to the tray and make some playing cards. As always, you can change your text and the options for the materials. In this case, we'll create all four colors and we'll include the text on the cards. Download the PDF, print out the cards, and you've quickly created minimal pairs cards for your student. The generated PDF has a watermark on it showing that we were not logged in when we created it. If you purchase a subscription, you can create an unlimited number of materials with no watermarks. While the minimal pairs cards are the most common ways to get minimal pairs, Lesson Picks can create any of our materials using these same pictures. While we have these pictures in our tray, let's create coloring sheets to match. We walk through the wizard again, and this time we have coloring sheets that focus on our target minimal pairs. This way you can embed these words in your therapy without just doing drills. I hope this demo has shown you the power of the tool and that you find it useful in your practice. If you have any questions, Please contact us via our contact page or via Facebook or Twitter where we're always active and listening. Thank you.